Hello friends, good evening. My name is Navin Kumar. I am a classic educator. So today we are going to discuss about uh, general studies paper 2 that is um, CSAT. So friends, this second paper is a very important paper. It is a qualifying paper in the civil service. right? So uh, let me know one thing here. Okay. Friends, silly. In civil service only now second paper na yaak bada matwa anta healthy thena thanda re. E paper niu pass saadre matra nam gyan apanta thanda re first paper only nam the eligibility akta kanta do anta na healthy kanta do. Right? See, here it is. C set civil service aptitude test anta healthy thena friends. So, e C set only nam gyan syllabus of preliminary examinations anta healthy kanta do paper two anta na healthy thebi. How da? So, idhar only number of questions test baratte. Right? Eighty questions anta healthy thebi. Then Total number of marks and 200 marks means students per question carries 2.5 marks. So, per question carries 2.5 marks, 80 questions there, that is 200 marks here. Second thing here, total time, yesterday time, 80 questions are So, that is 2 hours means 120 minutes. Next, we are so general studies paper 2 of civil service. Preliminary examination will be qualifying and the health other. Qualifying and the marks on the exams are count agala friends. Only in a panther is qualifying as the health account. Right? Compulsory paper new pass agla beku. So pass agli ke minimum requirement a nu and the health account. Marks yes to go beku and yes percent marks to go beku and the health other. So hagadaga namigile paper with minimum qualifying marks fixed at 33 percent and the health other. 33 percent and the for 200 marks we have to take a 33 percent. Means that marks is 66 marks and the health other. Right? So let me know one thing friends here. In a UPSC exam already not the Hogbeka Gitiga, but the COVID 19 year old in the cancellation agi October 4th again on Heli date announcement agi there, government in the right. But uh, this one the world opportunity and then a healthy Heli Kista Patinia Yakantandre. We got uh, more time to study. Okay. In the Yirtakanta, you know, Hechuna when a pant on the preparation Marbodu, but the examiner crack Marbodu and Heltakanta do. So many aspirants, civil service aspirants are waiting for the examinations. So wish you good luck. And uh, some people who are waiting for the first time and those who want to attend the uh, examination, okay, let them know the in the CSAT paper how many subjects will come, in that subject how many particular topics will come, right. Then how many questions will be rises here? I told you before here, 80 questions, 200 marks for 120 minutes. And the health Other friends, so let me go for the next one here. <coughs> so general mental ability topics. Okay, I'll go one by one. So in the C set, there are three parts are there again. Okay, so that three parts is a there are three parts in the C set paper. So the first one is reasoning, the second one is numerical ability, then comprehension. For these three parts, they divided as a 80 questions means one third question one third and the one third and the health account the health friends so e one third one third one third and the why i am telling you and the subject is c side and the end cabinet and the full mathematical irute at a full comprehension irute another mindset is the country but he lay in a pant on the muru subject on a serpent to is he said paper ready at the country the health in so friends here it is e one third but the numerical one third Comprehension one third and third third. Some people felt comprehension is the toughest one to those people. They can clear the examination by reasoning and numerical ability. Right? Some people felt a numerical ability is tough to me. You can go through reasoning and comprehension and some basic uh, numerical ability questions also. Right? The reasoning part is everyone will do the reasoning part. Okay? That's a wonderful and uh, it's a very easy topic. Okay? You can predict this one. Okay? The same numerical ability also. Then here comes a little bit of toughness. Why? Because you have more concentrate on the comprehension. Why? Because you need to judge the proper answer for the proper sentence. What are the given in the examinations? Okay. Most of the student felt toughness in this comprehension paper. So let me see in the reasoning part, which all the topics comes and the where the question rises. Okay, now here it is. So in the reasoning contents, what are the questions comes in the reasoning contents here? Okay, so analogy, right? The analogy on coding decoding, here it is alphabet series, then direction and distance test here, blood relation questions, same numerical questions, number, then Venn diagrams, 
So here, first we saw that analogy coding alphabetical series, direction, blood relation, number series and Venn diagrams. Okay. Friends, uh, everyone can do these all things. Not only this asking in the only UPSC civil services, in other exams also, these all are compulsory questions. When you attend the any competitive examination, you will easily get to know that, okay, these type of questions, right? Again, it will rise in the civil services. Not they will give the continuously, they will select some topics like coding, decoding, blood relation or number series. Then we'll apply it in the question paper, okay? So, we'll continue next. Logical Venn diagrams. So, Venn diagrams and logical Venn diagrams have a lot of differences here. Okay. In the Venn diagrams, we are putting the diagrams and we are judging the statements and the conclusions. But here in the logical Venn diagrams, the statements also given by them, the diagram also given by them. For which statement, which diagram is the right one? We have to predict that one. Right? So, that is on a logical Venn diagrams. So, this question is also one of the important question. Right? It may, may ask or may not be. Okay, friends. Next year, mathematical operation. That the basic calculation, 10th class calculations, okay, problems, right, board mass rule, seating arrangements is a one of the all favorites topic is seating arrangements. Why? Because uh, in this seating arrangements, you can get uh, two to three questions in the part one question, okay, now, see, uh, in this seating arrangement, we will get again two parts here, that is one line arrangement, sitting in a row, persons, person with profession, male, female, like that, okay. Then circle arrangement, sitting in a circle, right? So facing inside or facing outside, like that. Or some people facing inside and some people facing outside, like that questions they will also ask in the circle arrangement. And lastly, puzzle test. Why I am telling you, when uh, uh, some days back, on 24th, uh, KS exam happens, on that second paper, mental ability, the number of most questions comes in the sitting arrangement. Line sitting arrangement and the puzzle one question is there and one blood relation question is there and some other statement problems are there including decision making also it's a very wonderful question paper so you need to prepare this all the things to face the examination for October 4th okay friends let me see the next year decision making and problem solving right so decision making and the problem solving administrative ethics and decision making this is a very important topic for every examination this question is a fixed one it's a particular section, separate section for decision making. In the case also, they have asked five decision making questions. In UPSC, it's a compulsory questions. Right, friends? So, next, uh, good governance by predicting the sentence or uh, matching the proper word or filling the proper uh, uh, word for the fill up the blanks like that. Then, ranking test, inserting the missing characters by giving the some figures. Okay, there is one number is missing, there is a question mark, then we have to that predict that one by doing the calculation, then to find out the answer, that is the interest, inserting the missing characters, triangles, counting the figures, you all know that triangles and counting the figures, okay, then disaster management, logical reasoning and analytical reasoning, by here comes all the state problems here, see the statements and arguments, statements and assumptions, statements and course of actions, then statements and conclusions. Here friends, statements and arguments, they will give one particular statement and for that statement, they will give two or three arguments. Which arguments hold strong? We have to tell that. If nothing one is, means both the option is wrong, that there is option B is a neither. If maybe only one is right, we go for first option is a strong argument like that. Okay. Same as it is statements and assumptions. By predicting this question statement, we have to assume the situation, present situation and we have to take the decision. Same the assumptions here. Then statements and course of action, right? Statements and course of action means right now what happening, present situation. Okay. On the basis of that, we have to uh, judge the proper answer by analyzing the situation. That is course of action here. Then statement and conclusion. So already they given the statement and conclusion. Right? In that, whatever the in the statement, we have to study the proper statement and we can choose the answer correctly. So, these topics are very important. You can gain marks very easily by doing these all the problems. So, do not neglect in the examination. So, be prepared for this one. So, we will see the next one here. Friends, now we saw the first part that is the reasoning contents. Okay. I told you there are three parts. Okay, reasoning, numerical ability and comprehension like. So, now there is a second part here. 
she said part two numerical ability in this part also data interpretation will come i will not uh, uh, separate that again i will add it in this only right in numerical ability what type of questions or what type of uh, topics will come very simple friends what we have studied in the high school okay 10th class mathematics same syllabus is there for this numerical ability okay let me see here basic numeracy here it is number system see we have studied this in the high school number system then fractions elementary algebra then lcm and hcf okay friends average percentage order of magnitude profit loss and discount yes my dear friends uh, in the last previous of uh, 24th the what the case exam held okay on that percentage then profit and loss lcm okay then number system they asked the question on these topics here they selected these topics and they raised in the some questions in that paper too okay so it may be in your upsc also second paper right friends next year ratio and preparations partnerships and mixture time and work speed time and distance compulsory questions okay then simple and compound interest if they ask simple interest they are not going to ask the compound or if they ask the compound they, they are not going to ask the simple or if it may be they can ask both also their choice right friends next year permutation and the combinations probability clocks and calendar friends this is a fixed question clocks and calendars the previous question papers uh, what we are all us the analyzing okay when we are solving one question is a fix on calendar or maybe a clocks okay like a uh, time and speed or time and distance like that friends next sequence and series we studied the number series same sequence and series questions here next in this part only introduction to data interpretation this is a very important topic why because in this part two to three questions will rise in here why because in one question it may be a three to four or maybe five questions will rise okay in one particular see there are the options here they may give any one here their choice but we have to pre, uh, perfect this all things here in the examination numerical ability let us see study of graphs okay in that tables pie charts circle one okay then bar charts and graphs line graphs and mixed graphs data sufficiency okay there is a choice they can ask anything else friends okay so be prepared mostly pie charts or table or bar charts or line charts they are regularly asking the questions uh, whatever when we analyze the previous question papers okay friends next part see that part 3 means comprehension here comes the very difficult part to every student okay why i am telling the difficult means uh, that numerical reasoning okay i'm not telling that's a very easy if you are not practice means that is also difficulty okay so this part means uh, what the students think what the students thought in the examination this there is a huge para is a time waste of reading that one and we have to answer for one particular question there is again three questions so they will uh, what they will do they skip the questions and some in this only comprehension they will give similar words and opposite words here okay in this para only particular question sir what is the meaning of this particular thing in this para this opposite word similar word or opposite word like that okay in comprehension what type of questions will ask they will ask the recent issues okay national international emotional okay or any local for example local means uh, what the present situations are going on in india for example nowadays uh, situation is uh, covid 19 right in covid 19 other uh, different different com, uh, countries are uh, they are uh, producing the vaccination but still our country is doing work okay but didn't come with a uh, new any news just just uh, telling means uh, just uh, predicting that that uh, we are going to uh, introduce this vaccination by different different companies like that questions comes in the comprehension by predicting that one we have to answer the question here so let me see what all type of uh, comprehension questions will rise here interpersonal skills including communication skills right friends so types of communication skills here okay so uh, one uh, we think at comprehension means uh, just we think that uh, they will give one para english any story para then we have to 
choose the answer and we have to answer the question not like that in that comprehension okay elements and skills of communication this type of question will rise here and uh, essential features of effective communication and uh, barriers of the communication see the next year communication flows and uh, communication networkers then emotional intelligence then stress management okay regarding the what the question is we have to predict that one right next year leadership styles and as well as the last one is a uh, conflict management okay this type of uh, questions will rise in the uh, comprehensive right friends uh, it is a uh, csat paper is a uh, paper is a compulsory paper okay don't neglect in your examination and uh, be alert which question you are going to going through in the examination why because the time is very important you just you have to only thinking that there is a 80 questions we have 120 minutes time but the questions are not easy in one sentence or two sentences okay especially in the comprehensive right we can do numerical ability and uh, that reasoning part but in the comprehension we need more time okay so one third one third is there another maybe i think so 26 or 27 questions rises in one particular part okay so i think that you all got the informations of three subjects uh, which all topics comes in your examinations anyhow friends so be prepared all the best for your uh, examinations for upcoming in you know, october 4th i wish you good luck for you people to clear this preliminary examinations to all my students and those who are writing for first time writing the new other candidates also right thank you very much i'll come with uh, once again with a new topic thank you